Morning team. So first trip for the year. It's so Amber and Jesse. Um, we had a bit of a rest day yesterday, catch up on some sleep for these guys. And we've just hit the hill this morning. Amber's a bow hunter. This catchment we've just been in there's just a spiker and a few vines. A couple of pigs. Nothing that's of interest to us today anyway. So we'll go into the next catchment and see what's in there. We've just picked up this stag. There's two down there actually. I'm trying to have a set properly in there but they're not looking too bad. We might have a crack. Just waiting for the wind to pick up so it's coming up the valley. Just to try and figure out what the wind's doing and we'll see if we can get close to these two stags. One of them's roaring, the other one's not, but they're both about the same size. See how we go. So we've got two good stags. They're right next to each other, but they're right down here in the river. Stags are just around the corner over here. Um, we've just come down a bit of a bluff system. The wind's doing some stupid stuff, so we're just trying to work out how we're actually going to get some. Um, we're just going to sneak over here. The wind's coming up at the moment, and then go from there. See if we can get a look at them. And with M's up the top at the moment, and she's lost sight of one of them, so we just need to know where he is, really. So there was a ten point down below, the one that we could see sitting down. And he caught it, must have seen us, I think, and stood up. Went upstream and he scared the one that was sitting down in the open. So the one that was in the open then came downstream and he sat down under a tree. So we've left Jesse back up on the ridge. Stag's just around this corner. He's sitting under a manuka tree at the moment. Jesse, so he was up there watching everything that unfolded and currently the stag ran up here. Hopefully he's got some footage of him. So we'll walk our way up the creek and carry on. What happened? Where'd he go? How close did we get? 20 yards. So you were about right. <laughs> <laughs> he, up there. he must have smelled us. The wind changed as soon did as we it? hit the creek. Yeah. Oh really? Yeah. That's, yeah, because we got it on film. He started, all of a sudden his head went like this. And then he's looking around. And then he got up under the tree and off he went. Yeah. Cause the wind was great all the way, one of those bends and then it, it's Switched doing this up. right now. Yeah, we're like, Makes yeah, sense. I think we're screwed. Okay, but we'll carry on. Yep. yep. How close can you get to a gut? Three or four yards. Way. 
so let's tag. I'm not sure if he had a satellite stay with him or not, but we had a bit of a look through the trees and seen a six or an eight. Real skinny head. We're just not sure whether it was the one we were following or not. Yeah, one of the hinds picked us up. And then we had a wind change as well. <laughs> not ideal. So we'll go back up. So that's tag. We're not sure if the one we saw was a satellite or not, but sounded like this right below them, but they've all gone now. Amber's actually four months pregnant, so <laughs> she'll hopefully get some sleep again tonight. It's a little tough. <laughs> Oh. So I don't know how much we got on camera, but we just snuck in on a nine pointer. 15 yards, we can only see them from the neck up. And we turned the spook. Probably not an animal we're going to shoot anyway, but it's all good. Next, day two. A little bit of a late start. These guys are still getting over their jet lag, but the stags are on. Let's get into it. There's a few stags roaring here, which you might hear on the camera. There's a couple of three up in this draw or gully. So we're just going to side them into here and see if we can get an eye on them. So we've just had a wind shift, so we've had to go 
come off the top of the ridge by over behind the camera. I'm going to cut round and side around this face. down on the creek bottom there. They're stocking in on a massive 12 point. Alright, I bet you they're within. Right, I don't know how much of that we've got on camera. Not much, I don't think, but that stag that we've been following for probably the last three or four K. <laughs> didn't know that we were following him and we've um, got an arrow on him and he's down just around the corner. So we got him behind this rock just here and he was just in here and Amber got a shot on him at 40 yards. Yeah, good. 19 weeks pregnant. 19, 19 weeks, pregnant. weeks pregnant. Can't and get we, your hands on him, eh? And yeah. we busted butt for him. Yeah, we've that, done some Ks. That was not yeah. an easy, easy task. I didn't think it was going to happen. I didn't he was either. Just, just kept yeah. getting away from us, eh? Yeah. Like, up there on that wall, it was like, oh, he's going to stay there. Nah, kept walking. And then a couple of close calls stalking up on him when mm. we got behind if cover. That Simon's goat, like, <laughs> if that goat wouldn't have got between you and him, you probably could have got a shot when he was in that little cut. Yeah. 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 Right, we've got to get your hands on him, eh? Yes. Yes, we got a lot of work. <laughs> Yeah, so me and Amber have been talking for I think six years or maybe seven. And yeah, let's just put this giant on the ground. How many miles? How many ridges? Just in two days? Yeah, day two. So the arrow is a little bit far back. Mm. You just had to put a bullet in him to finish him off, but he was gonna die, there was a lot of blood coming out where the arrow was and then the tats caught something very major. But yeah, we didn't want to see him suffer, so we put one in. Yeah, we got him off. baby Z. <laughs> and Amber's four months pregnant. Twenty weeks. Ooh, it was not easy. Always worth it though.
You have some work to do, Jesse Lee. Yes, you do have some work to do. Jesse's a taxi dumbass. What's that? <laughs> Jesse's a taxi dumbass, so. Yeah. He can help me with the work. Taxi dumbass, pack mule. Yeah. <laughs> Good when the client brings her own taxi doing this with her. <laughs> he enjoys it, for sure. <laughs> Almost capped out. We got the meat, we're taking pretty much everything. We're gonna have to do two trips though. So my pack's ready to go. Pack's loaded, first load out. We'll come back for a second one. This is gonna hurt a little bit. We're gonna lose some sweat. That's all right, that's what it's all about. First bit of uphill done. We're just trying to beat the storm. <laughs> Let's go. We've got another trip to go yet. Straight up there. Just heading up here. As you can see, we're losing a bit of sweat. This trip's actually going to be the light one, the next one's going to be heavy. It's all good though, that's what it's all about. Yep. Maybe a rest day tomorrow, we'll see how we go. Yeah, back at it for <laughs> another stack. <laughs> so we're just unloading packs. And we've emptied all the meat out and me and Jesse are going to head back down. And we've got the head, the cape, a hind quarter, a front quarter, and a back stacks to go. Let's go. We're nearly back at our dropping point into the river. Down the river a little bit, and we'll sort the rest of them out and then start coming back up here. Doing well, Jesse's going good. Yep. It's still rain or it could even be snow. On the hill one behind us though that could be coming this way so we're just trying to hopefully get back to camp before it rains. Just loading up. Okay. Another bag of meat. And we're here. It's gonna be hard work but we'll be up. Load it up, let's go. And it's raining. Probably first. Yeah, you can keep the pace if you want. It's going to be slow. That's all right. <laughs> Small steps, one foot in front of the other. Jesse's going good. We're nearly there. Don't need the defib yet. That's it. We don't need a defibrillator yet, do we? Not yet. There's the girls on that saddle there. Yes, We're getting there. 100 yards to go. Um, as we said, Amber's four months pregnant. So, she's going to have to do the final bit. We will have to make her, I reckon. Yep. She's got to put it on her back. Just the head. Yeah. Yeah. So they're walking down. That's as far as she can go. Yeah. We'll go a little bit further for them, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. I don't want her. A little bit. We're nearly there. We're getting closer. We're puffing the. Ten more yards. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that heavy? It's like 20 pounds. Fuck, he isn't. <laughs> well, you have a big bowl of meat, too. Now they gotta have a domestic. Huh? Domestic. Yeah. Take a screenshot. Job done. He's a handsome boy. He's a handsome boy. <laughs> well done. Little spot. <laughs> 